Hey, it's Jones Laughlin. Welcome to Insights from the Jones Zone, where I give you a way to master your week in three minutes or less. Um, you know, when we think about managing the struggle too much to do, we often think, oh, if I just had more time to put in my day to get things done. And that's a part of the process. I wonder, however, if sometimes we need to stop and go, what's a financial investment that I could make that would help me be more productive or to get the right things done? And that brings me to this weird device around my neck. Uh, sometimes when traveling by air, I fall into a deep sleep. And then when I wake up, because my head's been hold down, then, then I have this headache that stays with me for the rest of the day. And while I want to get to my hotel, my destination, and get a lot more work done and, and take care of those important things, I just don't feel like it. So I get some things done, but I'm not nearly as productive as I should be. So I was reading an, an online article about travel um, items, and I saw this uh, advertisement for a TRTL pillow. Uh, and as you can see, it gently supports my head instead of that harsh uh, hold like an inflatable pillow would, and it should help me get better sleep when on a plane. I looked at the price, $29.95. Oh, that's a terrible price to pay, I thought, for such a thing. But I begrudgingly purchased it, and I gotta tell you, if it was a $99.95, I'd purchase another one. The ability to get off a plane and refreshed and renewed and be able to focus on my work or relationships in the evening has just been fantastic. So that's one example. Another one for me is, is AirPods. Now I know they're terribly expensive and you don't maybe have to do AirPods, maybe do some other type of, of wireless um, uh, earbuds, but I have found them to be so effective in helping me to, to coach more um, efficiently because I can be more mobile, I can stand up a little easier, it's just an easier way for me to communicate, which means I'm getting things done more efficiently. Now maybe it's not a physical device you purchase to help with your overload. Maybe it's something you pay someone to do. And you may say, well, but Jones, you know, it's going to be $100 or $200 or $250. What's your time worth? Look at what the time that you could spend with your family, with a loved one, engaging in your own hobbies or self-interest. What's that really worth to you? And if you stop and weigh out the difference, I think you'll come out on the side that, yeah, it's worth the investment because I get to do more of those things that are most important to me, my family, my job, whatever it might be. This is Jones Laughlin. I hope it's a fantastic week for you where you're willing to financially invest uh, in this struggle of too much to do so you can get more of your most important things done. Thanks for spending a few minutes with me today in the Jones Zone.